For me, Northern Soul was music, was the sound that I was hearing. I'd never heard music. We uh, uh, so, the feeling that that was put into it by these black soul singers. Amazing. What a lot of these black artists were singing about was the truth. And that inspires me. And for an age of 13, 14, we I started getting into Northern Soul. I had this weird, remember the weird record players that you used to get? You'd have lived. And you had to catch out of seven, I'd catch out of the V45s. Well, we used to get. Yeah, my auntie is maybe getting off my auntie if we here for a wee while before it just broke. And that's what I used to play the, the, the 40 feds on it. And uh, my first, the first thing that is a pure crap Northern Soul record there. And it's not even a Northern Soul record, but it, it, it was a connection to other soul records. That, that I would go and search it through here and that, and it was skiing in the snow. It was a terrible northern soul record. Skiing in the snow. Skiing in the snow. Down skiing. No, that's the name of the song. I can't mind the name of the band. But that was it, because Ed listened to that record, and there was a lot of people dancing soul in the church hall. It was at St. Vincent's. And they were dancing that, and a few people said that's northern. And I went, oh. I sort of thought it was a new. Again, at the time, I thought, oh, it's quite different. But what that did do, that opened the door to other different pure northern music that I got into. Well, for me, for me, and for all my mates that, that were involved in uh, northern soul, especially the fast northern soul, which had to be working in casino. I started going there in '77, uh, although I'd been open for phase '73, and it closed in '81. Uh, the oldies once a month uh, that went on at Wigan for me was out of this world. It was like heaven. We're getting about half of the dancing right enough, but it don't. I still, I have, I have a wee go. I don't dance so much now. Like I've got a few mates. I've got my wee mate Johnny White. He'll, Johnny will dance for Scotland. Uh, great wee dancer. And there's other dancers there as well that dance the whole night. Um, one I should really mention is uh, Stoke. He dances till he drops, and I mean that literally. Because I can remember we were in Manchester Ritz and it was the very last record and it was the very last beat on the record and he'd done a spin and he collapsed. <laughs> so he dances till he drops. <laughs>